Each kidney is supplied with blood by a single renal artery that arises on its respective side of the aorta before dividing into five segmental arteries that enter the hilus. Within the kidney, each segmental artery branches into several lobular arteries. The lobular arteries further subdivide to form interlobular arteries, which branch off into afferent arterioles. Blood flows into the glomeruli through the afferent arterioles. Blood flows out of the glomerulus through the efferent arteriole. The afferent and efferent arterioles regulate glomerular capillary pressure by selectively dilating or constricting. The kidney's venous blood, now filtered, flows from the glomerulus via the efferent arterioles into the peritubular capillary network, a low-pressure, reabsorptive system surrounding all portions of the tubules. This arrangement permits rapid movement of solutes and water between the fluid in the tubular lumen and the blood in the capillaries. The peritubular capillaries rejoin to form the venous channels by which blood leaves the kidneys and empties into the inferior vena cava.